Hey, it's your favorite cat. No fancy backgrounds today. I just want to get down to business. Let's get down to business. Firstly, Karen, I saw your story, Ocean Speed. I left some comments. I love the story. Uh, and I left some suggestions, so you read it out. Nothing strange about your reply, by the way. Perfectly, perfectly fine. Next, uh, I've got a question by, is it Kwa Kwa? What is Envy Envy rule? I, I have no idea. I have never heard of that. Sorry. Next, Brienne, are you still going to teach us English in Genie Book? I, haven't I been teaching you guys? I don't know. Anyway, my February schedule is up on my blog. Check it out. drfwz.wordpress.com Okay, next. We end. I miss you. Can you teach more classes? <laughs> Yo, check out my February schedule. It's crazy. I teach like Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And like four classes on Saturday. But Mr. Fawaz, why don't you teach on Monday and Thursday? Yo, your boys got to get a break sometimes, man. I already teach on five other days. I need, I need off days. Monday, Thursday is my off days. And some of you already know I fast on Mondays and Thursdays. So that's a bonus, you know. I don't have to break my fast midway through the lesson or teach while I'm thirsty. Win. Okay, what else do we have? Cyrus, I... <laughs> that seven-page muda. That was awesome. I don't know why I loved it so much. So thanks for sending that. Ila, of course I remember you. Um, yeah, I know you're not here anymore on Genie Book, so, uh, well, there's this channel, there's a blog, so, we'll see what happens next, okay, I, I do want to make something, uh, yeah, okay, uh, that, I'll, leave it, I'll leave it at that now. Chinsi, why, asks, Chinsi asks, why don't I teach P6 Genie class English? So, one thing is because of the number of classes we have now, we have to split the load, right? And amongst all the teachers, I'm the only primary school teacher. Strange enough, so I feel the most comfortable teaching lower primary, so I volunteered to take the, the 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 bulk of that load. So with the P1 to P4 classes, most of those classes, my schedule is full. So I think I have one or two P5 classes, and that, that is as much as it gets. So the P6 classes are taken mostly by Mr. Lewis, I think Teacher Shah also. They, they were secondary school teachers, so it kind of works because... Now when they teach the P6 classes, they know what the P6s will do in secondary school. So it's very useful for them. Okay, and to be very honest with you guys, I'm not going to lie. I, I don't really enjoy teaching P6. Not because of you. It's not your fault. You guys are awesome. It's because it's an exam year. It's PSLE. And with that comes all these expectations that I don't personally subscribe to. I don't think the PSLE should be as big a deal as people make it out to be. It's just an exam. You guys are just 12 years old. But because I'm in this position where I have to be a teacher, I have to do this and that, it, it's more painful for me to teach and be focused on the exams. Uh, you know, I, I don't have a choice. So uh, I'm a bit relieved that I don't have to take P6 classes. Uh, at the same time, I do miss you guys. So what are we going to do, man? Anyway, your P6 teachers are awesome. So that's, that's awesome. That's, that's incredible. Okay. Karen has another question. If the character we are writing in the story has a flashback, do we write the flashback with I or with she or he? Good question. That depends. Are you writing the story in first person or third person? First person means you are the character. Okay? You are the main character. I walked over to the door and opened it only to find there was no one there. See, I. And then I remembered something that happened 10 years ago. Knock, knock, knock. I'm coming, I said as I rushed towards the door. That is first person perspective where you, uh, the, I, the writer, am the, I am the main character. Okay? But if you write from the third person perspective, that means you are like an invisible narrator in the air watching the story, telling the audience what's going on. Then everything will be he or she. So for example, uh, Desmond. Desmond heard someone knock the door. So Desmond walked towards it and just as he was about to twist the handle, a memory hit him like a wave. It was 10 years ago when something like this happened to him. He was only 5 years old at that time. You see how it happens? You see how it goes? It's, it, only, it depends on how your story is written. First person or third person point of view. That's all. Okay? Next, Cheng Yan says, Hi, opinion on hamsters. I had hamsters as a kid. Uh, to be fair, <laughs> they are cute, but I just found them boring. Not so much interaction and they just want to be in their cage doing whatever it is they do. So I'm not going to have hamsters again. I, I love cats and 
if you are the kind of person that likes interacting with your pets, then arguably hamsters might not be the best. I do know friends with hamsters and mice and gerbils that adore them. But if you think about it, your hamster isn't going to crawl up on you and cuddle when you do your work. It isn't going to appear out of nowhere and sit on your face while you sleep. No, it's going to be in the cage most of the time. Yeah, you can let it out, but it does its own thing. I mean, I do believe hamsters show love, but it's not as expressive as other animals like like maybe even rabbits or dogs and cats. They will legit look at your face and meow and woof and whatever else. So think about that. Think about what you like to have in that pet. And if you do decide to get an animal, then make sure you are ready to take care of it 100% of the time and adopt. I don't believe in buying animals. That's my advice. It's a life. It's a living thing. We don't put a price on living things, right? Again, my advice. Do whatever you want to do. Excel, thank you for the nice uh, comment. And last one, Ani says, what do you call a flying butt? A butt fly nearly got me. Okay, that's it. That is a very short list this time. Uh, cool, kind of relief. So that's it. I'll see you and I'll see you next time. Bye.